Hello and welcome. Uh, it's Glenn here from breedingsex.com. I'd like to invite you to our latest project to convert this wonderful 1980s caravan into an insect breeding business. Um, we've been breeding sex for 14 years and we've had a lot of people really inquire about how to make an insect breeding business and I guess we're basically in the process of making a series of podcasts and webinars to help people be able to convert uh, their front yard or, or a shed or a garage into an uh, insect breeding business. Now, we've got this beautiful 1980s um, caravan, which is uh, 16, sorry, 18 foot or six meters. That's uh, about two and a half meters um, across. And we've chosen a caravan because it's quite versatile. Uh, some people have, may not have a, a shed. Some people may not have, uh, maybe renting and they can't actually breed insects inside for, because the landlord would not like that. So what we've really thought of is maybe, how about we just get a caravan, something really cheap, they can roll straight up um, and virtually anybody can do that. Now this caravan was only three and a half thousand dollars. I drove 400 kilometers, it's road, road worthy. It was quite, um, quite good on the road. So, you know, there are a lot of cheap uh, caravans and shipping containers around. Again, shipping containers are great, but uh, not everybody can plonk one of those in, in their um, property. So this, that's why we've gone for caravan, just to prove that concept. But anyway, come on inside and um, I'll show you um, what is, what's on the inside. So as you can see, we've got a pretty dated interior, this um, veneer, which is uh, from the 1980s. Uh, and the first step we're going to do is demolish all this. And then we're going to close off the windows and we're going to put it in insulation. We've got um, lots of rolls of insulation. We're basically going to insulate the whole, the whole area. Uh, and have it climatically controlled. Uh, so as you can tell, it's a typical caravan. It's got a uh, you know, sink area, it's got a, a, a living area, and in the back here was um, another seats and cabinets. I've already started to demolish that. Uh, so yeah, it's, it's pretty basic, but it's actually got a lot of room. We can actually put, um, for six meters, we can put containers all along one side with about a meter in the middle and um, one, uh, another row of containers on that side. So we're going to be able to fit a lot of insects in here and we're going to benchmark that and give you a guide. We're actually going to produce uh, podcasts and webinars. We've already got uh, books. Um, it's one of the most comprehensive book series, um, 160 pages. We've already got that. That actually explains how to breed insects. Um, so this next step is actually about the economics, trying to, uh, you know, to go to that next step, you've got to know that you're going to make money. You've got to know how many insects you're going to produce and that's kind of the, the purpose of this exercise. Um, so, yeah, if, now, if you've come across from our other webs, um, other Facebook pages, we do actually have one for, uh, you know, the Complete Cricket Breeding Guide, there's a Facebook page, and we did have Wildlife Hub, I'd invite you to come across, we're amalgamating those pages into a, a, our new website, which is going to have everything, the commercial, uh, the breeding and the edible insects aspect, so it's called breedinginsects.com, come along, um, like us, and follow us on this journey, and um, yeah, we'll keep you updated on how we progress and um, see you along the way.